Hello everyone, welcome to the Design Shop. My name is Sudhir Molpuru. I am the business manager within industrial and healthcare business unit of Maxim. Today I want to talk to you about the Max Health Band. Max Health Band uh, is one of our complete uh, evaluation platforms that Maxim has designed to help our customers not only validate Maxim solutions, but also to validate their own use cases. And today I'm wearing one of the Maxim Health Bands. The Maxim Health Band comes with an Android app uh, and it connects via Bluetooth to an Android uh, device that is running the app. So the Max Health Band brings together four different elements or four key elements of any wearable device. It brings together the signal processing uh, solutions, which are, uh, the, which are also known as analog front ends. Uh, Maxim has designed some of the industry's best lowest power analog front ends, fully optimized for risk-based applications. So the health band uses Max 86140, one of our um, industry's leading analog front ends. It also brings together the optomechanical design, uh, which Maxim uh, applications team has developed over uh, the last few years in, and now are helping customers design better wearables. And it also, it also brings together the brains behind uh, some of the wearables, the algorithms. Maxim owns a portfolio of algorithms that can extract heart rate, step counts, activity classifications, which I'm going to show you later on. And the Maxim Health Band is fully integrated with um, motion compensated algorithms. Last but not the least, to extend the battery life and still be able to run all the sensors on the Max Health Band, we use Max 20303, which is our smart power management IC, again specifically optimized and designed for wearable products. So customers can use Max Health Band for two different, uh, two different ways. They can use Max Health Band to extract the raw PPG data from the optical sensor, or they can extract the algorithm output, which is post-process data from the health band. All of the information is transmitted via Bluetooth to an Android app and stored on the tablet or the PC or phone for you to download. With that said, let's go to the gym and take a look at how the product works in real world, and then we'll come back and look at some of the features of the mobile app and the health band. So we're gonna see the demo of uh, Maxim Health Band. And uh, this is Alison Infantino. She's our senior marketing manager. She's graciously agreed to be a volunteer today for this demo. Uh, as you can see, Alison's wearing the health band and uh, she's currently at rest. So if she presses the button, you could see her heart rate display on the watch and you will just see the same thing on the mobile app because the health band is connected to the mobile app uh, through a Bluetooth connection. As you can see, her heart rate is at 120 beats per minute. That's probably the cameras. So, Alison, why don't you get started? While Alison is uh, running on the treadmill, you can see her heart rate go up, and you'll see that also reflected on the mobile app. And as she's running, we can also see her step counts going up, her calorie consumption going up. So this health band, as I was explaining before, can track your heart rate, step counts, activity classification, energy consumption, all of those things. And another important thing, uh, uh, as, as you saw Alison wearing the watch before, the watch has to be snugly fit. So it, the optical, optics have very good contact to the skin, so you can get a better heart rate accuracy, especially during motion. So as you can see on the app, her steps are going up. The heart rate is going to take a little bit longer because there is an averaging feature that is built into it. So it's going to take a little bit longer to uh, see the high, uh, the increase in the heart rate. But you can see the step counts being counted in real time along with the calorie consumption. So Alison, you can go ahead and stop now. So as you can see, her heart rate is at 125 beats per minute. Now it's at 130 beats per minute, 131. And if she rests for some time, you'll see the decline of the heart rate also, or the downward trend of the heart rate as well on the mobile app. So let's go back to the shop and look at some more features of the mobile app. And I'll talk more in detail uh, about some of the things that the mobile app will allow you to do with the health band. So as we've seen the demo in the gym, I wanted to take a few minutes and show you the mobile app uh, that comes with the Max Health Band. As you can see from, from the mobile app, uh, it, it's a very uh, easy to use interface. It has optical heart rate on the top left-hand corner. It has step counting, 
calorie consumption. And if you see the last option that says raw data on, that means the, I'm all, the max health band is also streaming the raw data to the mobile app and storing the data. So if I want to see the raw data, I simply click on the raw data box. And now I can see my heart rate on the top. Along with that, I also see my raw PPG sig uh, signals coming through. So both the algorithm output and the uh, raw PPG data is being stored on the Android app. So if I go back and look at the menu options on the top right corner, you have a couple of different options to choose from. The first one is sampled or continuous mode. What this is doing is a sample mode will allow you to sample the heart rate every few seconds or every few minutes to save battery power. On the other hand, if continuous monitoring is critical for you, you can go and uh, you can move, you can configure it to run in the continuous mode. So as I as I do continuous or sample mode, it sends a uh, buzzer signal to the health band to switch the configuration in real time. So the configuration settings are being uh, sent from the app to the health band over the air communication. And also at the bottom, if you see, there are three different options that says HR, raw, HR plus raw. What this is uh, doing is HR is basically algorithm output. So if you're only interested in the algorithm output, not the raw data, you select heart rate, then your raw data option becomes uh, switches off, switches off. So you'd no, you no longer have access to raw data. But on the other hand, you're only interested in the raw data, then the raw data box switches on itself and the heart rate or the algorithm output goes off. Or the third option is I can actually have both. So it's completely flexible. And again, you can export uh, the database if you're interested to post-process the data or e evaluate the data offline. And the last one is disconnect, if you want to disconnect the health band from the mobile app. So as you can see, it's a very simple to use a mobile app that comes with health band. And it's a complete evaluation platform that you can use either to validate your own use cases or simply evaluate Maxim solutions, whether it is our power management, whether it is our biosensor or algorithms. So if you're interested to know more or want to purchase one, uh, please visit Maxim website. And I also wanted to point out that this device, Max Health Band, is also available as white box licensing for B2B customers. If you're interested in white box licensing opportunities, please contact your local Maxim uh, account managers or distributors for more information. Thanks for watching.